hi guys welcome to simplifying tech and programming so in today's session we are going to check how we can code from mobile there is often spare time like uh, while you are traveling or while you are waiting for something then uh, why don't we invo invest that time into like uh, coding from mobile so in the play store there are lots of uh, options available for uh, coding apps like uh, we have something like uh, AIDE, then we have Decoder, then we have Java and IDE. So out of these, I find Java and IDE is the best offline application in order to start coding with the mobile application. So Java and IDE you can find on the Play Store also. But somehow if you not able to find on Play Store, then uh, I have made some arrangement. I have uploaded it on Google Drive. So link is provided into video description. So you can download this APK and you can install it on your uh, mobile and you can run this. So this is the easiest way we can go. Okay. So th this uh, <clears throat> Java in IDE supports like a C, C++ also. And uh, we have lots of uh, sample code also here that we can try. So here uh, like uh, they have provided uh, all the programs in details like suppose you want to check for uh, java date then there are uh, lots of uh, application it is already developed they have given as a sample application so let's say this is the like a java date example and uh, it is which is printing like today's date so here we can like uh, we can uh, try running also so just uh, you can see the triangle option on the top so that that is for the running the application so we can run also so if i hit on this run so it will print the today's date so today's date is saturday this 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 okay so uh, what we will do so we will go to file and uh, we will create the new project and we will see how we can start coding from the mobile so you can say new java console project click on this so give the project name like uh, java mobile project okay so package name give as a sample main class name is a uh, hello java mobile just click on okay so it will create whole project structure okay so you can see java mobile project and uh, here java hello java mobile okay so just click on it so you can see you you got the package you got the hello java mobile dot java so it is automatically created also it it have created one public class and it will it has created one main method okay so go inside main method and just type system or we will uh, take some uh, variables so we can say int a equal to two semicolon int b equal to equal to three okay semicolon and just we will print this by using system dot out dot printer then so let's say system dot out dot printer line so you can see it is a uh, intelligent also so it is providing the options also okay so here just say a so we we are trying the multiplication so we will try some calculator example so we want to multiply two numbers so i am just uh, multiplying a into b so with our output should be 3 into 2 it is equals to 6 okay so locate the triangle option on the top and it is for running the application so just hit it yeah so you can see the result is there into the console that is six that is output okay so just like that uh, like uh, we can take one more example where like uh, we can uh, give the input from the console and uh, it will uh, uh, run the program according to that input okay so here you can locate your project structure and just say in the sample same package sample you can just hit on the plus icon so it is giving this option java file so create new java file 
hello scanner mobile okay so create main function so it will create the main function automatically okay so this is the scanner mobile application so just we have to take uh, like input from the console so for this we need to import one package import java dot util dot star okay, semicolon okay so this package we will get the scanner so now write the scanner so it is intelligent it is providing options scanner dot sorry scanner scan equal to new scanner okay inside that give as a system not in so we are giving the input from system so we have to give system dot in okay so let's say enter then what we will do so we will print the input command system dot out dot print ln okay enter number or enter first number to multiply okay okay so copy this we need one more time so you have copy option also and then here take the input so how we can take the input <coughs> so int a equal to scan dot here we have option like next int yeah so just here okay so co paste this is out we have copied and uh, enter the second number second number okay so again we have to copy this as a second element copy and let's say int b equal to scan dot next int okay and this copy the output copy the system dot out dot print the line. we have to print the output right so we have to just need this template output is a into b okay so what we are doing so we are uh, like uh, <coughs> getting the input from the console and we are like uh, multiplying this uh, to numeric values and uh, we were just printing it so our program is ready so just like uh, we have to run it so locate the triangle on the top and just say run okay so we got the error so we haven't added the quotes so just add the quotes and add here plus sign yeah that's it so just run it again 
oh again comparison error okay so we have one extra okay so run this program now yeah so it is giving enter first number to multiply so we will give five then enter then enter second number as a multiply so we will give six so output should be 30 yeah so output is 30 so this way like uh, we can uh, write uh, <coughs> programs in order to read the values from the console so there are lots of options here that uh, i will tell you so like uh, it is a premium it is available in premium version also so then uh, we have log cat also like where we can see the log of the current uh, compiler or you can say whatever the activities are going on then there is a java sample code also there so here you can try out uh, these categories example the examples are there like for example suppose we want to go for loop examples inside loop these much examples are available so we can try one like a java pyramid example so here uh, this is the example where we have to print the pyramid like this uh, line number 7 to 11 so if you want to print this parameter uh, pyramid then just you have to add the for loops we have to design the for loop in order to print that stars okay so just we can try it by uh, clicking on the triangle icon on the top so just hit the yeah so we got the pyramid also so like this we can try the any examples uh, this is the offline application so lots of uh, examples are available to try it out so this is very user friendly application and this is very like uh, uh, easy to use application so that like uh, we can try it out and uh, uh, we can use our spare time in order to like uh, learn new things okay then we have like a document info where you can locate the file that you recently edited so like this uh, in the mobile uh, you can go for this path to locate your application then we have lots of option highlight language then editor settings oh compiler setting is there so so uh, you can run uh, any version of java till 1.9 like this and then we have uh, highlighter language encoding editor settings so in editor settings like uh, you can change the font also you can like uh, uh, like uh, edit the id options also like text size and font size everything like this so these options are available like you can edit find and replace also go to line so this formatting the source so everything is available so this is the best uh, application in order to uh, write your programs onto the from the mobile itself yeah so thanks for watching so stay tuned for the further session so we will coming we are coming with the interesting topics thanks a lot